this is yet another attack on the rights of Illinois parents at the hands of the majority party. During the final week of the fall veto session, the majority party decided to use the time to work to repeal the Parental Notification of Abortion Act. As mothers, we strongly believe it's a parent's right to be made aware of daughter's health and their health care decisions. Parents are not, however, required to provide consent. This is a major medical procedure, and to think that parents' consent is needed to require a school teacher to give an aspirin to, as we said, pierce your ears or get a tattoo, why would we think it would be a good idea to not involve a parent to be notified when a child is looking at a major medical procedure that will affect them for the rest of their lives. Senate Republicans say the current law provides safeguards to vulnerable minors. Sex trafficking experts have already noticed, noted that traffickers seek out states with no parental involvement. And if we vote to repeal this law, we will help make the daughters of our state a target. A target for them because it's no longer an obstacle. The existing law already provides alternative avenues for minors who are victims of abuse or are in danger. As of now, if a young girl seeks an abortion and is a victim of abuse or neglect, they can declare in writing to their doctor the circumstances of their situation. A doctor that can then perform the abortion without parental notification. A minor can also petition any circuit court for a waiver of the notice uh, requirement and may participate in the proceedings on her own behalf. Polling has repeatedly shown that a majority of the people of Illinois, including those who are pro-life or pro-choice, support parental notification. This is an issue about parental rights, whether we believe it is okay to keep parents in the dark about serious health care decisions made by a minor. A minor 